Kelly? Well, it's a bit of a different start for this Thursday morning compared to what we have been getting. We are more cloudy, a little bit warmer too, and we're getting some rain showers out there. So through today and tomorrow, you want to keep the rain jacket on you. If you're going to be outside, uh, there's a chance that you get hit by some showers, especially this afternoon and also through Friday. Cloudy skies up towards the port of Kalama now. In Portland, we're seeing temperatures in the low 50s, and we are seeing some showers now at the airport. And again, showers are around this morning. You may be running into some damp roadways out there. Uh, so we can keep the rain jacket on you. So what we're watching is this uh, low system working in again. You can see that here uh, that counterclockwise spin. Lots of rain up towards the coast of Washington and also Oregon too. So behind the system, lots of cool air working in. And when we get that sister that set up here in the region, we tend to get thunderstorms so by the afternoon. We may see some instability and some convection thunderstorms may develop and already offshore here. We are seeing some larger cells uh, with some lightning again offshore, but some heavier rain is working in now just uh, passing through seaside there and moving in towards Astoria and a little bit up north there. So some heavier rain is out there now in Portland. We're seeing just some light showers scooting on by as we head towards the afternoon. We'll see those rain showers picking up. Uh, so again, a chance for thunderstorms today everywhere in green up towards the foothills of the mountains that extends out towards the coast further south into Eugene and also up into Vancouver towards southwest Washington uh, by the afternoon. A chance that we see some heavy rain cells out there or even thunderstorms that could produce hail and even lightning. So here's our rainfall future cast. The showers will be very scattered in nature here and also fairly heavy at times. This model does put a line of thunderstorms down the I-5 corridor as we head into our afternoon. So again, that'll be the time frame that we're watching out for more severe weather. As we head into Friday, we'll still see lingering showers from this system. So again, we'll be tracking this wet weather through Friday. By the weekend, we are much uh, more dry. Here's our temperature trend. 70 degrees is our average for this time of the year. Highs today, low 60s. So real cool until we hit uh, Saturday there. On Sunday, back in the low 70s, a bit more mild. I think Sunday will be the best day over the next several here that we get some good outdoor weather. So upper 50s, low 60s today out towards the coast. We'll keep those spotty showers going, mainly cloudy, and the chance for some thunderstorms out there uh, through the morning time and the afternoon thunderstorms more possible through the afternoon today in Portland and down the valley highs in the low 60s out towards uh, central eastern Oregon. We'll see a slight chance for some light showers temperatures near 60 degrees and same for the gorge low 60s today with some light scattered showers and sun breaks as well. So here's that seven day forecast. We keep those temperatures cool in the 60s going into the weekend, but we do dry out Saturday likely starting out cloudy with a bit of fog out there, but uh, some sun breaks by the afternoon on Sunday. Day. We're back to dry conditions, mostly sunny and temperatures more comfortable in the low 70s. Back to you guys. All right. Thanks, Kelly. It's 650.